So who wants to be courageous to come on up so I can uh, do some muscle testing demonstration right now? All right, good, you're from North Hollywood. Okay, fantastic, good. So I'm gonna go check your muscles first. Hold this arm up. What are you eating? Um, okay, so that's gonna bother us. Mine. You're weak and you're weak. He's weak on both um, anterior deltoid test. What does that usually tell me? Honestly, he's dehydrated. I'm gonna give him some water. Okay, step zero. My office is that patients come in and dehydrated. So I'm gonna see if that works. I have my water bottle out in my waiting room, and I have all my patients. I actually ask them to drink water before they see them because more often than not they're dehydrated. If I want to do this advanced work, I, I have to send them back to the same. Good, hold your arm up, picking up, much better. Huge. Okay. All right, excellent. And every computer system has a self-diagnostic mode. So if your computer goes down, your technician opens it up in safe mode and it, it checks all the directories and subdirectories. Your car's got to check engine light. It goes on, so the car still runs, but the mechanic finds out what sensor is going on. So our body has one too, and I, I check four reflexes. So one is a third, third eye, higher intuitive point. So I'm gonna to touch right here, and the strong arm goes weak, and that's, that's correct. Like it's reverse polarity, both strong. If I don't touch it, solid. And then the second reflex, I'm gonna to touch right here, in your eyes, and that's a dehydration reflex, and that's some self on it. You just need a little bit of water. This is a self-communication reflex, and that's not so good. So I fix that by just tapping the heart chopper on the breath in. Exhale. There go. Still there. We've got something else going on here. What is it? Um, this is pot versus uh, pot. Uh, <laughs> let's open that up. <laughs> Share with us the, uh, the, the emotional trauma. Yeah. yeah. Um, actually, it was uh, physical, but I mean, at the time I was under stress. In high school, I got T boned in an accident. So uh, I feel like that stress, every time I see a, a car. car coming from the right side, I flinch. So. All right, let's have a look at that. What's wrong? Okay, so think about the car crash, that, that moment of impact. Yeah, smashing me down. Are you thinking about it? Okay, take a breath in. And out. Okay. Pushing up. Think about it. Better. Close your eyes, think about it. Okay. And on the side, think about it. Have a moment, think about it. Stronger now. Okay, I forgot to ask your number, but I think you said it went from like 8 to 7, from 7 to a 6. Mm -hmm. Check in now, where is it? Four to five. Okay, so by, okay, so that's good. Think about, so now think about driving. Think about, like driving and you see a car, you know, coming towards on the right hand side. See so more, so that's how, let's see, three of that. Okay, take the breath in. Exhale, again, eyes open, okay. Think about that again. Just driving today, right? I'm going to you. Good. And close your eyes, think about it. Fantastic. From here. And eyes open, think about it. Okay, good. Check back in. Two, three. Two, three. Okay, so we went from, I'm calling that take and go from, you know, I guess six, seven to a two, three. And it just might trickle down. So check with me tomorrow, and if you drive from the drive back, what's different? Thank you. Thank you. 18 years ago, it was a stillbirth. It was 
that traumatic edge you want to see if she cleared all of that out. Okay, so hold strong. Hey, don't think about it, just keep the mind clear. Check this four weeks up please. That's okay. So that's when we need to be dehydrated on the little water. And by the way, I actually am using filtered alkaline water to make it fun and better. Stand up? I don't know. I'm down. Okay. 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 Pushing up. Over there. Better. Okay. Okay, so um, still working with the hospital. Okay, so um, you can go there when your mind dying. Okay, so yeah, when you verbalize, we're gonna find it. So uh, it's there. So you're gonna bring whenever I. When, I want to test, is it a shock trauma event? So what I have to do is just tilt your head back slightly, and that doesn't negate the weakness. So, uh, and, then, and then you can also see if there's an emotional issue, and then you will put your hand on the forehead, and that's not it either. So it's actually a combination of, let's say, there's shock trauma, there's emotional trauma, and there's the mix. So this is the mix. And the way I sort of figured out to test that is I just do this little flip at the wrist, I think, with more intention, and that's it. So it's like, you have, it's all together in one. So I just want to dial that in, take it in. Exhale. Again. And that's open. And hold the arm up. And if you check, make sure. We didn't blow you out, we didn't. Okay, think about that snapshot, it's still there. And do it again. I think that's it. Exhale. Again. That's open. Exhale. Let's have it again. Okay. I don't think it's about it. Good, I don't think about it. The terms. Let's have it again. Eyes closed, and then again. And then eyes closed. So the difference between eyes open and eyes closed, eyes open is conscious, eyes closed is subconscious. And then right in the hemisphere of the brain, so I want to make sure we are checking everything. Mm -hmm. Left side, eyes open, eyes closed, and then right side, eyes open, eyes closed. 